Hey everyone, it's Sarah and I'm here with a Bath and Body Works haul. Um, I got a bunch of new items. I got some employee gratis items and then I did exchange four hand soaps for four new ones. So I'm gonna just get started. Um, I'm gonna start with the elephant in the frame, I guess. Um, I did pick up two of the Bath and Body Works Wooden crates, they retail for $10.50. I used my employee discount on them, so I got them for $7.35. And they're adorable. I really, really love them. Super cute. And I think they'd actually look cute in my bathroom that I don't have yet, but I'm planning on doing when I move my bathroom in Primitive Americana, and I think that might be cute. And you can always turn it around. It only says Bath & Body Works on one side, but in all reality, I'm probably going to have the Bath & Body Works facing out, so... Um, but for $7.35, I decided that wasn't a bad deal, so I was going to do it. Um, let me show you the exchanges really quick. I exchanged two Honolulu Sun and two Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin hand soaps that I had. Um, I got two of the Creamy Luxe Kitchen Lemon. Kitchen Lemon's a favorite. And then I got two of these. These are the Lime, and I don't know if it's Turmeric or Tumeric, but I think that's... It's definitely an R in there. If anyone knows how to pronounce that, let me know. I love the packaging. It's really, really cute. And I'm not a fan of, like, wordy packaging, but this is adorable. So. There's the description on there. But I think it's really, really cute. And I think it would look cute in my kitchen someday. I'm doing it in a citrus theme, and I love things that look retro, and I like that a lot. So, um... So I did exchange those. I have, let's see, let's just do the gratis first, I guess. So we got to pick out a Shea, uh, one of the new face mask, face sheet masks. I picked the uh, See You Soon. I almost said Shea You Soon. I have a Shea one sitting next to me, so. Um, but this was a gratis. This is Sea Minerals and Hyaluronic, is it Hyaluronic Acid? what the back looks like it's supposed to be cool and refreshing it's got sea minerals in it but that's what that is so we got a face mask um let's see we got a where to go pocket back holder this is the one i picked out got to pick out a pocket back as well which i went with the island margarita which is not a scent i usually like but these are back this year same packaging as two years ago, but I just decided let's, you know, why not? Let's get something different than I would have normally picked up. Um, got a wallflower bulb. Picked up the Aloha, the Aloha Kiwi Passion Fruit. Um, <laughs> tropical Passion Fruit, Radiant Kiwi, and Fresh Coconut. I love Aloha Kiwi Passion Fruit. It's a really, really nice fragrance. And I'm glad it came out in wallflowers. I don't remember if we had wallflowers last year, though, or not. Um, but we do have, in Aloha Kiwi, we have the scent portables for the car. And suntan also came out. Uh, Rosewater and ivy. I remember those three for sure we do have in the scent portables. We have these little two pots here. One has in the sun... Um, body cream and one has the in the sun um sand scrub so interested to try the fragrance out i've had the formula obviously but not the fragrance before um we got to pick out select stores that are carrying this line we got to pick out, if you were in a select store you got to pick out a um one of the new active on the go items so i picked the dry shampoo out it is $16.50. Uh, let's see. Don't sweat it. Don't. Come on. Don't sweat it. Use the Style Saving Dry Shampoo for second day hair or post workout to absorb oil and sweat so hair looks and feels fresh. Made with aloe, cucumber, vitamin E, and is it kaolin clay? Um, honestly, for $16.50, I wouldn't pick this up normally. Like, I would not go out and buy it. However,. I said the one way I would get it is if it was gratis, and lo and behold, we got gratis 
like the next week or the next a couple of days after I said that I think it was the next within a, a day a few days to a week and then I said that the only way I pick it up is if it's in gratis so because I I get my favorite dry shampoo is suave believe it or not I hate Batiste I, I've tried it I think it's like I don't like it I love suave just suave um dry shampoo just the plain old suave dry shampoo I love it so um <laughs> like I said I'm not used to spending a lot of money on um dry shampoo so thankfully this was free I mean if I really like it then I might if there's like a when I try it out if I really really love it then if there's some sort of really good deal then I might get you know I might purchase one or two of them but I wouldn't at $16.50 I wouldn't buy it and then an on uh, in the sun roller ball this is a perfume spray but it is the size of a roller ball and I don't think the notes are on here no they're not so that is a great great gratis this time for sure um, I also picked up face masks were on sale um, they retail for $4.95 and let's see where my receipt go for that oh in my hand the whole time they retail for $4.95 um, they were on sale two for five dollars so you're basically buying one get one for a nickel um and then I had a 20% off coupon so they came down to two dollars a piece which is great I think I don't know that much about face masks though so please um correct me if that's not a good price but I assume it's a good price so I picked up the if you shea so shea butter and jojoba oil so it says rich and moisturizing I got that one and then I also picked up the love you very much um, and super fruit berry complex it's fruity and vibrant I have no clue on face masks like I had to ask one of my co-workers about my gratis because I had no clue like what's a good thing for my skin like I don't know which one to get so I was suggested the uh, the one that I picked up the blue one for my gratis the, this one to see you soon and I was also this is the other one she suggested was this one here the shea butter and then I noticed a bunch of people getting this on online and a bunch of people got this as a gratis this particular one and I just decided let's get one and see what the fuss is about so I picked that one up as well um, oh I also totally forgot I did exchange one wallflower bulb as well um, I think it was sweet cinnamon pumpkin I opened it and I was like nope not happening <laughs> so I picked up a coconut colada, creamy coconut spice banana dark rum. I actually have the candle sitting next to me. And to me, I just get banana, spice banana. I don't really get the coconut in there. If it's there, it's in the background. I know a lot of people get a lot of coconut. I don't know if it's, and a little bit of banana. I don't know if it's a batch variation or just our noses are all different. So, um, hopefully, I'm hoping it stays true to scent when it burns. I've heard you get more coconut but I'm hoping it stays true to banana and that there's no kerosene note or anything because I would love that if it's true to what it smells like. I also picked up some pocket backs using that 20% off and I'm so happy that the original packaging is here this year too. These are fresh for this year. I don't know if you can see them or not. I don't know if they're going to show up, but that eight right there, that eight, the first number is an eight and that was poured, or this was made this year. And I don't know if I can read it. 801, so that's the first day. Nope, hold on. 8011. 8011. So it was made on the 11th day of this year. So January 11th. So I am super excited that these were brought back. Cactus flower and coconut is one of my absolute favorites. If for some reason you can't find cactus flower and coconut, oh baby, that came out this year too is the exact same fragrance. And then I picked up two of the Sparkling Limoncellos. Um, both of these fragrances I will probably throw in one of the baskets that's available that I can use for the other job that is soon coming. I am recertifying for my EMT, so um, 
obviously there's hospital hand sanitizer and I have a whole ton of unscented pocket backs for a reason but these are on a little bit on the lighter side so obviously I wouldn't do it when I'm in with a patient but you know after a patient when we are like heading back to stage or whatever which is what we when you stage an EMS, you are um, basically parked somewhere because there's not little stations everywhere. So, um, you're staged sporadically around the area. Um, so that, you know, arrival times to get to patients are cut down that way. But um, I will probably put these in the work basket. I have so many pocket bags, guys, it's ridiculous. I have. And I have a whole bunch that I want to purchase still, and I will. Um, I had a ride along with the ambulance company that I'm taking class with. And I didn't have very much patient contact at all. A couple times, but not very much. I went through a half of a sanitizer, half of an unscented pocket back. I went through it in one shift. So I was on the ambulance for over 10 hours. A shift is 12. I was on there for almost an entire shift, so it was probably 10 and a half hours I was on that ambulance, so that's a lot of hand sanitizer for one shift. So I'm not going on a ban at all with hand sanitizer. I will buy them. All right, I picked up two candles as well. I picked up a carrot nectarine made with carrot seed and sweet orange essential oils. I think this one was on sale for $12.95. I don't know what I did with my receipt for this one. It's interesting. Um, my manager burned it. He said he really liked it. Kind of smelled like a um, a garden when it was burning. I'm interested in that one. That's like, it intrigues me. And I've heard it's really good too. And then this one, we actually had a lady return this. And I was thrilled to see it because I never got my hands on one. But it's the infamous Frozen Lake. Heck, I didn't even get my hands on a four ounce tester. Like, we sold those too. This scent was so incredibly popular. Made with juniper berry, eucalyptus, and lavender essential oils. I, have no, I don't even know if I like this candle, but just to have it in my collection, I'm fine with that. I kind of like it. There's something familiar in here. But it, no, it, it, like, it doesn't smell like eucalyptus spearmint. It doesn't smell like lavender or lavender vanilla. It just There's something in here that's familiar, but I can't pinpoint it, so... But I like it. I'm glad to have one of those. Like I said, someone, someone returned it. Um, and she'd had it since, I think she's holding on to it since like Black Friday. And she just didn't want it. And I said, mine, then, if you don't want <laughs> Not to her face, but I said, it's like, if she doesn't want it, I want it. So, because I'm, I'm quite happy to have that one. Um, that is the candle that we had like for two weeks and then it was gone. We probably sold out of it in two, three weeks. That's what it seems like on the floor, though. But I had, was working at that point. I was still working two jobs and going to school, so. But yeah, that is it for this haul. I hope you enjoyed. Um, there will be more hauls coming. Some exciting hauls. I'm sure there'll be pocket back hauls coming, too. But um, yeah, I have a candle haul coming. That is a bunch more candles that I got for $10 locally, so. And there's some really, really, really good ones in there, by the way. Um, but I will see you guys next time. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoy this video. Um, and I'll see you guys soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.